This video is on the top five AI penny stocks that you should have on your radar right now and stay tuned until the end of this video because we actually have just a little bit of a bonus for you on another investment inside the AI space. So stay tuned for that one. But I'm going to give you the first one right now before we even get started in today's video and that is ticker symbol S-O-U-N. This is the first NASDAQ AI stock that you should have on your radar right now. It is currently the largest market cap of all the AI stocks we're going to be talking about today at a 1.72 billion dollar market cap the rest of them much smaller market caps much riskier but also give you much more of an opportunity so i'm gonna let andrew here get into ticker symbol s-o-u-n and tell you a little bit about this one yeah guys if you're watching this video then you probably know the ai space has been exploding and that's really all because of nvidia right here that's currently sitting at 899 dollars it's up over 100 percent in the past six months and that is a massive move for a company that is currently sitting at a 2.2 trillion dollar market cap and now what i'm really getting excited about here inside of the ai space and overall in the stock market is that we have multiple different catalysts that are working in our favor not only is nvidia exploding here but also at the same time we also have bitcoin exploding through all-time highs which there's a little little sneak peek to what's coming at the end we have an ai sector in crypto that's doing very well as well and while all of that's happening we also have the s p 500 that is breaking through all-time highs so i think it's safe to say that we're really really close to going into a raging bull market if this keeps up for the rest of 2024 so if you were ever thinking about swing trading and getting into some of these stocks that can have very high growth potentials then right now is the perfect time to do that so what we like to do is instead of taking a look at the 2.2 trillion dollar market cap companies like nvidia that maybe you can get a hundred percent gain on we like to take a look at the smaller market cap companies which are a bit riskier but they have more of a chance to get you higher gains. So for example, we've called out stocks that have done 5X, 10X, 15X. And we've been doing this for the past five years now. And I'm, I promise you, if we go into a raging bull market, you will have some companies in the AI sector that go up 500, 1000%. Now SoundHound, not to get into too much exactly what they do, but if you come down here, they have a voice AI and spe speech recognition company and they were founded in 2005. So you can immediately see that since they were founded in 2005, this is a company that's been around for a while they've been around for almost two decades now so they're a proven company that's been around for almost two decades and in the past six months they're already up over 183 percent so we know that this company can make big moves for example back in january just in the past few months they went from around a dollar and 71 cent all the way to a high of eight dollars and 24 cents so if you were investing back here when they were around a dollar 80 you got a nice five to six uh x on your returns which is absolutely amazing which is what we shoot for so soundhound i think with this low market cap being at 1.75 billion it may not give you the 500 600 700 percent gains from now but you could definitely see a double up in this one if we see nvidia continue to push spot continuing to push and bitcoin breaking through all-time highs as well and i actually want to pitch it over to brendan right here to go over the technical analysis for SOUN so you know exactly where the support levels and resistance levels are at. And it's so important whenever you're trading so you can make an actual really good trading plan. So Brennan, you want to pull up the technical analysis real quick? Let's give you guys a couple key levels here for ticker symbol SOUN. So number one here and arguably most important since we've been talking about a lot of gap fills lately is there is a small gap here up to about $6.67. Of course, nothing major. It's about from $6.47 to $6.67. But considering where we are right now it's even more substantial considering we're sitting at about five dollars and 54 cents so now the next support level is depending on where we do well i guess we did close yeah we did just close so uh yeah we did technically break through some of the support right here the next big level of support is going to be down here at four dollars and 77 cents or also at about that psychological five dollar level but let's see if we can get back up here because you know most time most of the time almost all the time gaps fill and so that means we do have an opportunity here to fill this gap up to about six dollars and 67 cents break out of that and then this thing could easily be headed up back to those highs over the year um, which are up here at ten dollars and 25 cents maybe one more resistance level at, at around 791 to eight dollars per share so as far as the ta looks that's where we're looking that's where our support levels are and that's where the opportunities lie here on the ta but remember 
any piece of news, especially especially in the AI sector, could throw this entire TA out the window, and this thing could either absolutely explode off of good AI news, which, you know, given the trend in the market lately, I think the there's it probably will be good news, but also bad news obviously could send the stock down as well. So you always just want to keep that in mind. Now, real quick, before we move on to the second ticker for today, which by the way, gets to an even a lower market cap, guys, we actually just started a brand new challenge here at Team Alpha Trading. Now, guys, I've been in the middle class my entire life, family was in the middle class, and I've always said that the middle class is where dreams go to die, right? People are just enough comfortable in the middle class to where they are getting by, uh, you know, parents are paying for most of their things. They're, they're, you know, they got a car, they got a decent job. You know, they're making sixty, seventy, eighty thousand uh, dollars a year. They're doing decent, right? They have no drive to work hard because they already have most of their opportunities filled. They have these big dreams, but there's really no drive to get there, right? And that's, you know, kind of, you know, where I've been and where I've grew up around my entire life. But what got me able to break out of the middle class was trading. Trading was the one thing that was the opportunity that took me to the next level, right? It was a passion for me, something I love. And through that, you know, been able to just break out of the middle class, right? And so that's why here at Team Alpha Trading, we started a new challenge. The challenge is called break out of the middle class. So guys, this is a 60 day challenge here at Team Alpha Trading where we wanna help you learn a new skill in trading and ultimately break out of the middle class. And it also comes along with the cheapest prices ever here at Team Alpha Trading. So if you wanna come join us at Team Alpha Trading, give everything we offer, get all of the knowledge that we've been teaching our students over the last five years and over 4,000 students, see all of our case studies, all of our testimonials, guys, click that link in the description below, fill out the form, enter your name, your phone number, and your email team member is going to reach out to you we're going to talk shop and we're going to get you in there right away but let's move on to the second ai stock on today's list i'll pass it to andrew 100 percent. make sure you guys join the challenge in the next 60 days it's going to be pretty crazy we're going to drop a ton of value access to our trade alerts access to everything that you need to take your trading to the next level but let's get into the next stock of the day which is going to be ticker symbol nnox so nnox is a little more expensive than what we usually trade here at uh, team alpha trading it's currently sitting at ten dollars and 33 cents However, you don't only want to take a look at the price. You also want to take a look at the market cap. And as you can see, the market cap for this one is only sitting at $589 million. Now, this is going to be the first stock that we talk about today that's below a $1 billion market cap. Now, if we take a look a little bit at the price action here, and I'm going to pitch it over to Brendan here in just a second so he can talk more about the technical analysis levels. But as you can see, for the year to date, we're up over 59% right now. So back in January, this stock was sitting at around $5. We had this massive push, right? And you can kind of see how this correlates with Nvidia. So if you like uh, zoom out on Nvidia a little bit here, you can see it really started making its big move in January, going all the way into February, right? So take a look at NNOX right here, January going into February. We were sitting at $5 at 60 cent. We were basically going sideways for the entire month. Right after Nvidia made its big push here, this one catapulted all the way up to $12.95, which was over a 100% move. And these are the type of moves that you want to take advantage of. Now, it's very important that not only when you're swing trading um, inside of a bull market here, you want to be in the right sector, which I think AI is a phenomenal sector, but it's also very important to make sure you have a good trading plan. So many of you go into swing trading with no trading plan whatsoever you don't have a take profit price you don't have an entry level you don't have a stop loss and those are all things that technical analysis can help you with which is also what we teach inside of team alpha trading make sure you join our 60-day challenge so instead of just taking all five stocks and you're like you know what i'm just going to buy into all of these at a random price you want to find support and resistance levels so i'm going to pitch it over to brendan right now so he can give you those support and resistance levels for nnox right here so brendan what you got for the people this one definitely looks a little more bullish than the last ticker we looked at as far as the TA goes. So, and that's just because of the momentum we've seen, we can see here on the daily chart. So pretty strong support level around this $9 and 16 cent level. You know, we've bounced off here three times just recently and have hit this level multiple times in the past. And, you know, just kind of recently, we also were able to make a big bounce off of this all the way up to about 1433 and then two smaller bounces up to about $11 and 54 cents. So currently we're sitting at $10 and 33 cents. But why I say this one's a bit more bullish is because we've already bounced off of that support level right here. 
I guess you could say making the opportunity a bit smaller, but we did bounce off this level. And looking at the last two times we've bounced off this level, uh, you know, we've went to eleven dollar and fifty three cents both times, and actually wicked up to twelve twenty nine and twelve sixty seven there. So I think the opportunity here, the first level of resistance, is going to be up there at about this eleven twelve dollar level, give or take within that range there, depending on the wicks and all that. And then if we break through that, head to fourteen dollars and thirty three cents, and a break above that could really send us up high here to about twenty dollars per share. So those are some of the levels here as far as the downside, $9.16. And then there is a gap to the downside here that at some point probably will fill to about $7.22. So those are the levels that I got on NNOX. Pay attention to them. Combine that with your AI fundamental analysis, and you're going to be way, way better off. So I'm going to pitch it back to Andrew here. He's going to go over the next one. All right, guys, make sure you are paying attention to when it comes to technical analysis. It's probably the most important part of this video. We're going to give you great stocks that you should be watching, but you also have to make sure that you have a trading plan. So let's go ahead and get into stock number three. So the first one was SOUN, second one was NNOX. Make sure you add those to the watch list. And the third one is going to be BBAI. And the name of this company is Big Bear AI Holdings. Now, this one is at a much cheaper price. This is about the price that we like to trade at typically here at Team Alpha Trading, anywhere from that $1 to five dollar range we notice those stocks typically do very very well now, as you can see in the past six months here that this stock is up over 40 percent if you take a look here this one had a big pop ending of february going into march before retracing back to those levels so if you were looking at this one around january at around one dollar and 58 cent one dollar 70 cent level this one made a move all the way to four dollars and 33 cent which was again another 200 to 300 percent opportunity and you can start to see why we start to trade some of these smaller market caps and speaking of market caps this one is a little bit lower sitting at 485 million so what you'll notice is we go lower and lower the next two are even lower market caps is that you will see more volatile moves especially from the last one i'm going to show you a very very volatile move uh, but you just get much more of an opportunity to get those big rewards so if you ever you know see any of those guys that post 500%, 1,000% gains, they all come from these smaller market cap opportunities. And what I've noticed has worked very well for me in the past five years of trading is finding a very, very hot sector. And instead of trading the biggest market cap stocks in that sector, I look at the smaller market cap stocks and I try to ride those up. And it's worked very, very, very well for me. So for BBAI, I think this one does have an opportunity to make another big move if NVIDIA continues to push up and SPY continues to push up as well. So I'll pitch it over to Brendan one more time here and he'll give you a technical analysis breakdown on some support and resistance levels so you know number one first off we're down here at about this dollar 96 level give or take you know you know down here on the chart but there's a lot of potential opportunity on the upside here now we do need to return to some of these levels we need to see some green need to, need to get some momentum here but there is a big gap here from two dollars and 96 cents to about three dollars and 56 cents and as we know gaps usually fill in fact we saw one just last week or maybe even two weeks ago but it just absolutely exploded up 70 percent and filled that gap so obviously, you know, we're sitting down here a little bit lower. We are holding support at a decent level right here. As long as we can bounce off this level, there's even a tiny double bottom there, maybe even arguably a triple bottom here. If we can bounce off of this level, head back up to the first resistance level at about $2.96, call it that $3 per share psychological level, that's going to be where that gap starts. Some stocks do get rejected before that, right? That's, you know, before they fill it. That's why I wanted to point that out as a resistance level. Now, if we break through that level, it's not a guarantee, but almost it's pretty good chance that we're probably going to fill that gap up to about three dollars and 56 cents and that's where real the real opportunity lies break out of that you know you're up here to, uh, at those highs at four dollars and eight cents so pretty simple love the gap fill on this one need to see some momentum to get up there first one thousand percent and now we're on the way to stock number four i hope you guys got your paper and your pen and you're writing all of this down so let's get into stock number four right here and stock number four is going to be ticker symbol bmr so bmr sitting a little bit higher than the last one bba i sent at a dollar 97 bmr is currently sitting at six dollars and ten cent but just because this price is higher it doesn't necessarily mean that it's at a higher market cap and you guys should know that so this one is currently at the lowest market cap that we've seen yet only sitting at around 92 million and what you will start to notice is that the lower that we go in market cap yes 100 these are riskier but take a look at this move that this thing made back in uh january going into february this one was sitting at a dollar and 55 cent and went all the way up to 16 dollars, which is around a 10x opportunity so that move right there is actually around an 800 percent opportunity so if you've ever want to turn one dollar into eight dollars or ten dollars into eighty dollars 
BMR gave you that opportunity literally a month ago before pulling back. And year to date, it's still up over 242%, even though that they did have a, a pullback and they are in the AI sector. So if Nvidia continues to run, SPY continues to run, and especially if Bitcoin breaks through and actually these AI coins and crypto start to run, then BMR could make another move back up to that area. But let me pitch it back over to Brennan so he can give you a quick technical analysis. Yeah, like Andrew said, the opportunities just get, you know, obviously riskier with the smaller market cap stocks, but also bigger and bigger and bigger. You can see this chart just absolutely explode up to $34. Yeah, $34.94 there. Now, obviously, we're not sitting there uh, right now, but it still shows you just the base potential opportunity. Obviously, stocks can always create new highs, but considering when they've already been there before, it shows you a definite opportunity. Will it happen? No one knows, but it's definitely an opportunity, right? But anyways, here, the big support level is going to be at about $5.42. Um, if we can bounce off this $5.42 level here or where we're at right now, we're also sitting at a nice EMA right now, then uh, I think the first level of resistance is pretty high. It's going to be up there at about $9.65 here. Now, I do think that's a pretty important level, especially as you approach $10 per share, psychological level, right? But, uh, you know, that's 50-ish percent higher than where the stock is sitting right now. So, nevertheless, pretty good opportunity to that first resistance level. Now, uh, the, the concerning part is if we break down below this $5.42 support level here because there is a gap to the downside. So right before we had that big run, there was a massive gap there, right? And you can see the gap is all the way down to about $2.19. And gaps do fill a lot of times. So what will be the key indicator here if this is going to fill is if we fall below this level. And we can actually see here um, that the gap started at about $6.06, .06, which is just about we're very 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 close to where we're sitting right now which we actually closed just above that level right so it's going to be very important here that we can open up tomorrow in the next several days above that level that way um you know that way we can maintain above that support level so super important right there and then as far as more potential upside you break out of that nine dollar and 65 cent per share i have 14.48 there and then a breakout above that you could be retesting those all-time highs once again so uh i do like this one only if we can hold that support above $5.42. Nevertheless, going to probably be one that you want to pass on and wait until we go down and fill that gap. Once we do, possibly bounce off of that, ride this thing back up if it gets some good AI news. So that's what I'm seeing there. Pass it back to you, Andrew. Now, this very last one, guys, that we're going to go over here, this thing made a massive move, all right? So if you were looking for the stock that went up 15, 20, 25x, 30x, 40x gains, the ones that make your wife admire you, your kids respect you, your friends want to be you, the ones that make legends. This next stock did that move, and we called this bad boy so early, but the people that got access to that were the people inside of Team Alpha Trading. So if you want access to all of our thoughts, all of our trade ideas, exactly what we're looking at in the market a whole lot faster than these YouTube videos, then you have to join us at Team Alpha Trading and you're never gonna get a better price than that 60 day breakout of the middle class challenge. If you're in the middle class and you're trying to get out, you need a new source of income. That nine to five job is not gonna get you there. You're gonna get stuck in the middle class. You're gonna get complacent. You're gonna have two kids and then they're gonna take all your money. They're gonna turn 18 years old and then you're gonna be with your wife. You're still gonna be living in the same house as you've been living in for the past 20 years. When if you learned how to trade, you could be living in that big mansion with a Ferrari with a Lamborghini that you really want and maybe even a protection dog like me and Brendan here. <laughs> so guys, make sure you join that middle class challenge. The link is down in the top pinned comment. So the next and final stock is gonna be the one, the only, ticker symbol H-O-L-O. -O. Now guys, this bad boy is only sitting at $3.63 and the market cap for this one is sitting at only 22 million. So a super low market cap. But Holo went, ho, 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 holy shit, way back in February. And we called this one, I'll flash it up on screen. The day that it exploded, we called this one at about $2.50. And this one, I don't have it pulled up on, on Weeble. I know it went higher than this, but on Google, it's showing it went all the way up to $66. And, you know, this was a massive opportunity. If you got in around $1.50, $2, this was a 30 to 40x opportunity where you could have literally turned $1 into $30 or possibly even $40. So again, with these low market caps, you do have a ton of risk because after this massive move, there's always a massive pullback as well. But Holo is also in that AI sector. And these are the type of moves that these small market cap companies can make. And I can guarantee you if NVIDIA continues to push through all time highs and Bitcoin and these AI coins that I'm about to bring to you right here at the end, start to make big moves, 
Holo could absolutely make another massive move to the upside because one thing I know about traders is they're always looking for those big move opportunities. And when a stock has done it before, they're more likely to do it again in the future. So let me pitch it over to Brendan here so he can give you the technical analysis. So make sure you pay attention here. Brendan, what are we looking like for as far as support and resistance on Holo? <laughs> Yeah, let me pull it up. But yeah, I'll just reiterate that um, insane, you know, th that we call this thing here a team alpha trading, right? Just want to uh, preface this and say like that does not always happen. But the important part is with our scanner, with the stocks that we're looking at, we don't miss opportunities like this. When they come, we automatically have them. They pop up and we're able to give the opportunity to all of our members, just like we did with this one. Andrew showed you the proof in the pudding of the text message that we called at $2.35. And as you can see on my chart, I know Google says a little less. This thing actually ran to $113 per share, which is just absolutely insane. And now, although this is the biggest stock that I personally have seen as far as runs go, uh, you know, during my trading, we have had multiple stocks run 10x plus, not often, of course, but multiple stocks run 10x plus that we were also to be there and able to capture the opportunity because of the scanner that we use. And once you come join us at Team Alpha Trading, not only do we text you this, not only do we show you the exact scanner and the stocks that we're looking at every single day of the week, but we also come on here and we do it live for you every single day of the week as well, guys. Like Andrew said, best prices yet. Join us at Team Alpha Trading. Link in the description below so you can catch stocks like ticker symbol H-O-L-O, -O, guys. Members made thousands, tens of thousands of dollars, even six figures on this stock right here off of small amounts of money just because of the percent gain that it ran. But taking a look here at uh, at some of the at some of the key levels here, it's a uh, it's insane the difference, right? So our bottom level support level is going to be here at a dollar fifty-five, and our top end resistance level is going to be at those highs at about one hundred and thirteen dollars, which is absolutely insane. But nevertheless, like Andrew also said, uh, because this thing has gone on a run before, it can easily do it again, and it has done it multiple times, guys. This thing has popped several, several, several times. You can even see uh, that you know, like. That you could just see all the pops that it's made right here, right? I mean, that was back in, uh, you know, 913 there that it went to $113. We can see here, uh, February, it went to um, $98 per share right there. But you can see even days before that, weeks before that, multiple pops up here to $42. Another pop up here to uh, $41 right here. Like, I mean, this stock has just $38 over here. Like, this stock just lives on these highs and lows so right now we're bottomed out at about this one dollar in uh well one dollar and 55 cents will be the bottom there but we're si currently sitting at three dollars and 70 cents so as long as we can continue bouncing up off of these levels guys i really don't see the first major major resistance level until about 1424 now to be honest with this one it's going to take some creators it's going to take some news right like it's not just going to be a, a simple opportunity here on the charts i don't think being that this one was so heavily traded by retail before I think we just wait for this thing to pop up on our scanner when it's making a big move. We'll see it. We'll alert it. You'll see it. You'll know. And that's how we'll find the next opportunity on HOLO. Like some of these support and resistance levels just barely make any sense because of how much this one moves. For example, after $14, we basically go up to $38 per share. After that, we go to $98 per share. And after that, we're up at like $113. So keep an eye on those levels. But more importantly, come join us on Team Alpha Trading so we can see when this thing pops and so we can capture the next big move on ticker symbol HOLO. 100% for all of you that stuck around all the way to the end, you got a sweet, sweet surprise. Because although we love penny stocks here at Team Alpha Trading, and that's what we started trading in our trading journey, we also have branched off into other ventures as well, like crypto, for example. And if you guys haven't noticed, Bitcoin has been making a massive move, pushing through all-time highs, and we're stuck around that $70,000 level. Now, who's to say if Bitcoin is going to continue to break through all-time highs, but if it or continue to break through its previous high of around 72,000, but if it does make a move into the 80s and the 90s, what you're going to see inside of the crypto market is AI coins absolutely explode. And if you guys were ever wanting my crypto watch list, here's every single coin that I have on my watch list. You can screenshot this, you can pause this, but some of these have done exceptionally well. For example, I don't want to name out any coins and you don't have to buy these at all, but there's a certain coin that you see on your screen that's sitting at around $1.27 that I was able to get in at around 11 cents. So that's a massive 11X uh, move that just I recently just got over the past three months. 
Now, as far as AI coins in particular, there's a few that I want you to put on your list. This first one is gonna be P-A-A-L-A-I. The next one is OXO.AI right underneath it. Those are probably the two highest market cap ones, a bit safer than the last one that I'm gonna give you right here. But as a final watch list for all of you that know how to trade crypto here, I would definitely be taking a look at GPU right here. That's another one that's in the AI sector. And then also, uh, this one right here, the lowest market cap one is going to be KNDX. Those are crypto coins that have already made big moves. For example, if I click on KNDX right here, you can see this massive move that it already made right here. So let's zoom out here and take a look at the yearly chart. This one was sitting at 0 0.019, or excuse me, 0 0.012, and made a move all the way to over um, 17 cent right here. I actually think it was really closer to 20 cent. So that's like a 20X opportunity that you could have caught right there. So keep an eye out on crypto for all of you that know how to trade crypto. Look in that AI sector because it's gonna be hot. But either way, this video has been very, very long. We're going on a 30 minute video. So you should have got massive value from this. Hope you guys got value. If you did, comment down below. Make sure you join us over at Team Alpha Trading, the 60 day breakout of the middle class challenge. And we'll see you guys in the next video. Deuces. Peace.